Greg, from a results perspective, it's been a difficult uh, past couple of days for our team or our men's football team. How would you evaluate uh, the past couple of days, a couple of days overall? Yeah, um, definitely disappointing. I suppose um, when we topped the group, obviously we had high hopes. But to be to the credit to the lads, you know the performances have been very, very good against Russia. We, we probably deserve to get something out of the game, and we were unlucky to go lose the game one 0 and you know it's disappointment and then I suppose, I suppose the intensity of this tournament people probably back home wouldn't understand it it's you know our fifth game now tomorrow in seven days and it's uh, it's really tough it's really tough so to pick the boys up after that disappointment and go again against Ukraine it was difficult but in fairness against Ukraine again I thought our performances are quite good and we're just not getting the look of winning at the moment but look we hope to put that right against France now tomorrow yeah uh, it's, uh, it has been a bit of a slog for the players and mm -hmm. One more game, they have to pick themselves up one more time. Where do you think the guys will find the motivation? Uh, to go one last one. Yeah, look, I think it's just a bit of pride. Like, obviously, you know, to to qual qualify for the quarterfinals is a huge achievement. You know what I mean? And we, we spoke about that. Like, we didn't want to just uh, reach the quarterfinals. Obviously, that was a huge objective before the tournament started. To reach the top eight is a huge achievement. But we wanted to try and push on. And I really thought that we deserved to ma make the semi-finals against Russia. So the performances have been good. Um, against Ukraine, again, you know, they scored in the 92nd minute, you know. And I thought we were starting to get on top. And we were looking like that. We we're going to maybe get a winner or, or push it to penalties. So I think the lads know, you know, they, they, they understand that they probably didn't deserve to lose the last two games and I think they want to go out in a high now. So that's their motivation is, is to beat France. And obviously, you know, we've played France a couple of times now, so this is going to be an interesting game. And do you think against Russia and Ukraine, it was more so that things weren't going right rather than things going wrong? Yeah, like I just felt that like the lads have put in a fantastic effort, you know, like to play against South Korea and Uruguay and then to play against Russia in the quarterfinals, you know, the small turnover of time frame for the, the games was, was intense, you know, and the lads put in a great shift and, you know, we really pushed them, you know what I mean, they were holding on and uh, I think, you know, we just just needed a bit of more quality in the final third and I think, you know, overall we've been dominating possession of the ball and our performance would be good, just trying to get that goal out to win the games, you know. And then... Uh, you play France uh, for, for the last time in the 2019 games. Mm. Um, how will you approach that game? Will you try, try to go all out to try and get a win and uh, put a bit of style on the end? Or it, uh, will you be more concentrated on just focusing on the result? Yeah, well, look, look. the result is the important thing, you know what I mean? That's always the way we always try to win, you know what I mean? We don't go out there just to play a nice brand of football. We go to win the games. And, well, like, I think with this, this this type of tournament, you have to keep the ball, you know what I mean? If, you, if you're chasing the ball and you're defending, it's very difficult. And, you know, it's our fifth game. So, look, we'll go and we'll try and play the way we've been playing. And the performance, as I say, has been good. It's just maybe in the final third, the lads need to step up a bit and, you know, maybe take the chances that we're creating. Because we are creating a lot of chances. If you go back over the last two games, we've probably created more clear-cut chances in the opposition so it's just probably that final quality but overall it's the same game plan you know we know what France are going to do so it's just uh, uh, we'll go out and we'll keep the ball and we'll try and make sure that we try and win the game